Boeing is telling airlines around the world to ground all 777 passenger jets with the type of engine that blew apart over Denver on Saturday. Amazingly, no one was hurt on the plane or on the ground, even as a neighborhood was showered with debris. We get more now from CBS's Errol Barnett. Tonight, there are critical questions after this catastrophic engine failure led to panic and prayers aboard United Flight 328. And all of a sudden, we heard this huge sound. Debris scattered across this Denver suburb. It's just dropping pieces. The NTSB says it is investigating two fractured fan blades, which you can see here in this passenger video. These new photos obtained by our Denver affiliate reveal damage to the fuselage. I think they were fortunate that the way this came apart, it didn't do uh, critical damage to the airplane. Former NTSB board member John Golia says also concerning is the uncontrolled fire. Last thing you want on an airplane is fire. Boeing is now recommending to ground all of its 128 aircraft with this engine. United is grounding the 24 it had in service, as is Japan Airlines, ANA, and Korean Air. United 328 is the third engine failure in as many years. In December of last year, a Japan Airlines plane had to turn around due to two damaged fan blades. And in 2018, a United plane landed safely after parts of its engine fell away. Now, the NTSB investigation will likely next focus on the engine's manufacturer, Pratt & Whitney, and its engine certification process. But the conclusion many have already reached is that when trouble hit, it was the well-trained pilots on United 328, Nora, who saved lives. Thank goodness for those pilots. Errol Barnett, thank you so much. Yeah.